So this is a question from gate 2018 from chemical engineering question number 51. A set of standard stainless steel pipes each of internal diameter 26.65 millimeter and 6000 millimeter length is used to make a plug flow reactor by joining them in series to carry out the degradation of polyethylene. Seven such pipes are required to obtain a conversion of 66% at 450 Kelvin. The minimum number of standard 8000 mm long pipes of the same internal diameter to be procured for obtaining at least 66% conversion under the same reaction conditions is dash. So this is a question from ideal reactors and the NPTEL reference can be found in module 1, lecture 13, basics of plug flow reactor part 2, chemical reaction engineering 1, homogeneous reactors by Professor K. Krishnaya, Department of Chemical Engineering, IIT Madras. So here, in this question, it is said that they, they have used stainless steel pipes to make a plug flow reactor. So, in the case 1, this is the dimension of the pipes they have used. So, the inner diameter will be 26.65 mm and the length of the pipe will be 6000 mm. So, they have joined 7 such pipes in series and they have made a plug flow reactor. Now, what they are asking is, if instead of this uh, stainless steel pipe, if they use a pipe having the same inner diameter, but different length, which is 8000 mm, but you know, everything else is the same. So basically, the inner diameter will be 26.65 mm. And even the reaction conditions and the reaction, everything is same. Even the conversion is also same. So what? Uh, we want to find is how many of such 8000 mm long pipes will be required to achieve at least the same 66% conversion. So, here basically the concept that we need to use is that since the reaction uh, conversion is the same, the reaction conditions are the same, and the reaction uh, parameters, uh, everything with regards to the reaction is same. That means the volume should also remain the same in order to provide the same conversion. So, if the reaction conditions are same, and also, the conversion is also same, then the volume of the reactor should also remain the same. Okay, so using this, we will try to see how we can proceed. So first, what we need to find here is the volume of the reactor. Volume of our plug flow reactor. And it is given in the question that it, this plug flow reactor is made of 7 stainless steel pipes of the 6000 meter cube, 6000 millimeter the length. So, volume of this PFR will be 7 into volume of 6000 mm long pipes. Okay. So, this will be 7 into volume of each pipe will be pi. Uh, pi d square by 4 into length. 
So pi into d square which is 26.65 the whole square by 4 into 6000. So if we do the max here the volume of PFR will come to 2, 3, 4, 2, 7, 9, 1, 2, point seven seven eight millimeter cube. So this will be the volume of the PFR in millimeter cube. So now if we use 8000 mm pipes instead of the 6000 mm pipes we need to find how many number of such pipes are required. So for that what we can do is number of pipes number of 8000 mm pipes will be equal to volume of PFR by volume of the 8000 mm pipes. Okay. So if we do this, we can find how many number of such 8000 mm pipes are required for this system. So, we can find the volume of 8000 mm pipes as pi d square by 4 into h which will be pi into 26.65 the whole square in pi 4 into 8000. So if we do the max, we will get volume of 8000 mm pipes to be 4462459.577 millimeter cube. So we already found the volume of the PFR as 2342791.278 millimeter cube so to find number of such 8000 mm pipes required number of pipes required will be this volume of pfr by volume of the 8000 mm pipe so this will be 2342791.278 the whole by 4462459.577 and this will rough if we do the max it this will roughly come to 5.25 now the thing to note here is that this Mathematics says that we need 5.25 of such 8000 mm pipes. But practically taking you know a fraction of the, the stainless steel pipe is not ideal or it is not practical. So what we have to do is we have to take the nearest next integer of the value that we got as the minimum number of pipes. So we have, we got 5.25 as our value. That means we need at least six of these pipes to achieve the conversion, which is 66% in this question. So the number of pipes will be six here.